Number 10 then from the 2009 Vance Tire. Use the Euclidean algorithm to find the greatest common divisor, notated by these brackets, of these two numbers, and express the result in this form, that's the sum of these two parts, so I'll be equal to that. So he's really expressing it in the form of a particular solution to a Diophantine equation. Diophantine equation simply meaning you've got a linear equation where the results have to be, well, integers, yes, but not to good old Diophantus because he didn't like negative numbers. But strictly speaking, a Diophantine equation is an equation where you only consider integral solutions. Well, the first step will be, what's this great, greatest common divisor? So, 1, 4, 6, 5, 4 being bigger than 1, 3, 2, 6 must be some multiple of it. No heroics here, I'm just going to use my calculator. And that gives me 11, so it'll be 11 times it, plus, just take away that 11, and multiply it back by the 1, 3, 2, 6, 68. Then you can repeat the process. 1, 3, 2, 6 is bigger than that. So 1, 3, 2, 6 must be some multiple of it. What multiple is it? 19.5, so it's 19 times, oh, 0 0.5, that's easy, so that'll be plus a 34. 60 is bigger than 34. 60 is going to be 2 times it, plus 0, so that's it finished. So 34 is the highest common divisor, so I can write this. 1, 3, 2, 6, 1, 4, 6, 5, 4 equals 34. And I can backtrack along that to pick up these multiples that are used to go back to the original numbers. So starting with this 34 here, that 34 equals 1326, take away 19 lots of 68. And that 68, so it can be replaced by 14654, take away 11 lots of 1326. So I've got one lot here, and then negative 19 times negative 11 will be 209 lots of it, plus the 1 is 210 lots of 1326, minus 19 times 14654. And that would be the required result. Not quite in that form. It says express it in that form, so maybe I'll just put it that, that way around then. So my result would be this then. I've got 1326 times 210 plus 14654 times, and that'll have to be negative 19 to make the greatest common divisor 34. So that'd be the particular solution to that Diophantine equation in this case. It would be A equals 210 and B equals negative 19.